It's time to replace this ladder with plastic, I think. This is clearly going to be a primary... Ah, we got it. Good. A primary in and out here, so we might as well go ahead and get some plastic in here. Lord knows we have plenty of it. Is that a bisolite right there? Tiny little chunk of bisolite. We'll leave it there intact. What is that right there? Phosphorite. Okay, cool. And then, uh, what do we have? Granite and sand. So we can do this and this. There we go. And we can just have him just go over here and just mop this shit up. Can't mop that up over there, though. It sucks. Good. We could, we could connect the door if you want to. 180 watts. Oh, wow. That actually costs more power than, uh, I guess it's because it's heavier. It's insulated. So that doesn't make sense. That makes sense. They look happily angry. Yeah. I wonder what they will... They're confined and glum, so they're not happy, but I wonder if they will continue to reproduce. Uh, let's see, 81%, egg chances 100%, but we don't have any... We don't, not tags, we don't know how long it's going to take for them to... You know, wow, they built that ladder really fast, oh my god. <sighs> that was very unexpected. I would like to get all of the trash cleaned up before we commit to this area but look at look at how much room we have for activities like seriously we could put so much stuff in here uh like all all, all of this and then some and we could stack it a little bit nicer too i think i feel like I have transformers and the whole deal and it's gonna be protected by abyssalite then we can open this up and put whatever we want down here you know one egg per lifetime then wild oh i didn't know that thanks ellen is that elon i think it's elon it's probably not Ellen. Sandstone. Hmm. We can actually expand and add more people too eventually. Do we have any empty beds? No, we have uh, six and four, ten. Although some people have comfy beds. <laughs> I feel like they're, they're kind of robbing folks, but nobody's complaining. Zero percent stress, so. The line, but whatever. I got you, man. Try, try, to, try to keep those names right. Ask somebody whose name they get wrong all the time. I understand. Requires emptying. Oh. What do they have to empty out? Oh, probably the salt. Hey, we got salt now, guys. Look at that. Let's see, we have a nice plastic ladder going all the way down, which is great. And then over here, we can get those things cleaned up. Might as well come over here and get these. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna leave that... Uh, mop this, too. Not on floor. Don't give me that shit. Don't give me that shit. A comic cab, yeah. The other one is uh, Miles. My first name, Michael, is spelt uh, E A L, and so you know naturally people assume that's uh, Michelle or something like that. Some people really fuck it up somehow. Mikiel, and it's like how? Why is this rushing over here? I guess it's because oh, it's just because it's uh, it's cooler over here. I'm guessing, right? What is it? 182 versus oh, okay. So it's cooler over here, so it's rushing over here because this is where it's dripping down into water. Huh. Neat. I'm just checking, I'm just checking. Mikhail, yeah, Mikhail. The, um... Uh, let me see. I, I want to say... Yeah, it's like Mich Michelle. Michelle, I get a lot. Uh, Mikhail, I get a lot. That's probably it, I think. That's about it. But yeah, they think that because the A, I don't know, the E comes first, that it's pronounced differently or something. Which I get it. It does look weird. But that's how it's spelled. Alright, so it looks like we have everything tagged to get removed. Uh, it's gonna take a long time for them to get over here and get all this stuff, of course, but... Uh, so we can just kinda leave them alone and let the water desalinator do its thing. Uh, these guys live in here happily ever after. Maybe we'll get another egg out of them, maybe we won't. It'd be kinda cool if we did, because then they could just continue to reproduce in there. Poke shell molts and everything, right? Um... Yes, there you go. Yeah, that's the the, the that's the, the one right there. With uh Wow, look at all this oxygen in here now. Man. Just so much oxygen. <laughs> uh, who'd have thunk? That's something that's putting out super hot steam, water, vapor, is uh producing both hydrogen and oxygen. Wow. Wow. <sighs> <laughs> okay, but this area is starting to become a fucking mess, though. For reals. This is, um... That's too much. We need more... 
<laughs> I don't know what we need more. We need to use more power. If that's what we need to do. We need to use more. We're not. Let's turn on the jukebox. <laughs> That'll do it. Let's turn on the jukebox. That'll solve all of our problems. Look at it. It's enroging on the base from the north. Oh, we have a bunch of hatches up here just chilling. Look at that. I didn't know we had hatches up here just doing this thing. They're just living off the land right now, I guess. Uh, uh, when I dropped to the directory, I was like, who is a comic cab? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, that's me. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, this hatch is just going nuts up there. How funny. Now they're all looking. Now they're all going nuts over here. Great. Good. Uh, let's see. Overheated. That's upstairs. Building likes resources. Micro mushroom, all that stuff. Yeah, some of that stuff, like I said, hammer, like some of this stuff would be great if, uh, we could just remove it using a mod because some of the stuff is useless like especially when it's like something's out of your control uh, when you look over here there's like over here this uh this area here might have a door that's overheating or something and because i can see it i'll get a notification that stays up here e eternally insufficient oxygen generation oh really by like by point that's gone now it, it was by what seven point seven point seven kilograms yeah, get out of here Oh, I'm excited about our new working space. I wonder if they got that clean. They got that clean. I wonder if we should start. I want them to clean stuff first before we actually start uh, moving in. I see that there's stuff here that keeps on getting deep, like getting flagged or getting removed. But yeah, how hot is this uh, oxygen? Really hot. Oh yeah. We have a tiny little chunk right here. What is it? 9.5 keys. Ooh, it's starting. Uh, if I can post mods, I can post a uh, suppressed current mod. Oh yeah, please do. That'll be helpful. I'll pop it open another window. Save it for later. Oh my god, Cliff. Every time I see that link, I keep forgetting about the... Uh, thank you, Hammer. Uh, about the link, the actual URL. This is uh, I'm gonna get Slick Donkey Amp Energy. <laughs> and don't forget to drink your slick donkey amp energy. <laughs> what a link on that. Jesus. <sighs> okay, the hydrogen is actually getting pretty low here. We gotta do something about it. What is up with this up here? I know that we have this pump that is set to turn on. Uh, oh, okay, well above. This will this will siphon a bunch of it out actually. Although it's probably good though, because and you know, part, and you know, okay, you know, one of the reasons why so much hydrogen is actually pulling down is because we're lowering the overall volume of gas in this space. So the overall volume of oxygen in this space is now floating around 1,200 on average because I have uh, atmospheric sensors all over the place to lock the vents whenever they reach 1,200, and that's just there so that way we can have a little flexible room. Like let's say if somehow we manage to get lava into the base or whatever, and it starts superheating. I have a whole bunch of emergency 30 degree oxygen over here just waiting to get like just dumped in somewhere to cool some place off if we need to. Um, not that that's ever going to happen, but you know what? It's just out there in space. We don't have to really mess with it right now. Let me see what we have. Award C. Look at that. Streamer privilege. Uh, <laughs> so because we're, we have less pressure in the main base area, everything else is starting to kind of creep on it a little bit. You know, we have gas shooting out from underneath. We have gas, you know, kind of creeping up from the top here. Uh, so yeah, that's what we got this stuff. Now uh, this one disabled long commutes. Okay, cool. I would like to solve that problem too, but I guess I think the threshold is just a little too, uh, it's just a little too, you know, it's just not very forgiving if that's what it is. I wonder why they're not building this. Mafic Rock. Ooh, motorbuckles. nuts. <laughs> we need more hydrogen, I know. Need more hydrogen. Don't make it out of mafic rock. Sedimentary rock. There you go. There you go. Look at that. Aaron's hug shot. Current Aaron's gonna be done. Hug shot. Just getting it. Oh, hold on. They've been dumping it all in here. <laughs> They've been dumping it all in here. Uh, I was like, wait, where are all the bottles at? They're dumping it in there. So let's uh, remove it from this one. This one has, yeah. Uh, oh no, it does not. Then I have no idea where it's at. There should be bottles of that stuff floating around here. Is there some in here that I don't see? No? Brine, but not chlorine. Uh, b -b 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 salt water. Well, hold on, let's do this. Aaron's. Let's make this a nine. 
get somebody to have it on their, okay, let's get somebody to put it on their current delivery and let's see where they go. No pending deliveries. Okay, so there's no pending deliveries. So there's none anywhere on the map. I don't know where, yeah, I don't know where they put that stuff though. They have another drip somewhere that's <laughs> just dumping s salt water somewhere. This is, uh, I already tried to check that, but I want to check it again. Salt water. Oh, it's salt water. Yeah, salt water at the bottom right there. Yeah, okay. You can't see it, but it's salt water at the bottom right there. See, if my picture wasn't in the way, you guys would have busted me on that. But nope. Must have been a bug. It's a lot of oxygen. Oh, that chlorine. Oh, man. We just have access to just, uh, just a wild abundance of resources. The oxygen isn't being superheated by space. No, there's no energy transfer. There's other for it to transfer to. I don't know how space works, man. Why is there one chunk of granite there? God damn it. They can't reach. It's out of reach. Unreachable. Son of a bitch. Okay, I don't need to babysit this. I want to. I want to so badly because I want to get started on this nonsense. Especially when I get this ladder out of here if I can. Because I don't need it. You get this all cleaned up. Maybe, wait, maybe yeah, let me babysit this just to get this ladder cleaned up. Because unfortunately, they don't. They, they kind of lack the ability to, uh, to, kind of systematically, like sequentially, bring things back. You know. So if I say delete this ladder, they'll delete the first fucking step and they'll leave the rest of them there. <laughs> They're just not that smart. Uh, but I could do this because I could go across and do that and that. So good, we could do a couple at a time. And then this over here, we'll, we'll take care of once they get that done. So zap, and then zap, good. I can do this and this, and also this. These are all nine, so they're gonna go over here and do this very quickly, fairly quickly, I believe. We have a wart seed sitting there on the ground. It's kind of weird. I wonder why. Like, not the one I just got, by the way. There's also a mod called Chained Deconstruct that will deconstruct ladders all at once. Oh, oh, does it chain it down? It's like whack-a-mole when removing scaffolding. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Huh. Well, do you want to link that one too, bud? <laughs> Jeez. I have a hundred miles on this thing. Oh, look at that. Look at that. The hammer hooking it up. Let's take a look at that one, actually. Oh, wow. Ooh, that almost seems like too much. Does it... is it slower because they're zapping one? Like, does it take into, into account everything that's chained together and maybe it takes... Like, if there's three ladder chunks, does it take three times as long as it normally would just one? Hmm. Um... Just takes the same amount of time. Oh, man, that's a tough... that's a tough sell. That's a tough sell for me. There we go. But I appreciate it, sir. As always. Okay, cool. So they could land, land there, they go do this here. Good. We have water coming out of this thing. Salt. We have salts. Uh, plenty of, of, yeah, plenty of this. So I think we're good. I think we can leave that alone for now and move on to the next project, which is going to be. Let me slow things down a little bit. Slow it down. Relax. Oh, hey, look at our natural gas is starting to deplete. This might be a problem. It's not gonna be a problem. 25 cycles. Uh, I think I will manually, because look, we have tons of gas here, but I think what we'll do is when this thing gets low, I'll manually go there and swap it over. But I had an idea last night while I was laying in bed, not able to sleep, of course, uh, of a way that I could basically have a valve, just a simple valve set up to control, to basically do a toggle back and forth between the main, which is going to be the two gas geysers, and the backup, which is going to be the uh, uh, the byproduct of processing the oil into petroleum, which is natural gas. So yeah, I wanted to uh, just have a toggle, you know, to switch to one as like an emergency backup whenever. But I think for right now, I will put a toggle on here that just says, let me see. Uh, boop. I'll put this, and we'll have this hit what? Why do I have this hit? Maybe hit the thing. I think that's to the right. 
There we go. And then when this gets to zero, yeah, there, yeah, I should do it. I'm gonna build that in a second. Speed things up. So many good guys on this map. I don't have any. You don't have. <laughs> yeah, it is, this is this is definitely an easy mode map for sure. Oh my god, I thought Killing Demon had no health. He's just chilling. That's his relaxation meter. That's why I need a relaxation meter. It tells me <laughs> that that'll tell me how long I have to rest in order to feel uh, not stressed out. Oxygen in the base is looking good. 1200. And you know, over here, we should check on the temperatures of these guys. Negative 30.8. Yesterday it was like negative 17 or something like that, so that is definitely cooling, which is amazing. This temp shift play 18, negative 18.8, but it just said it now it just toggled over to 18.9. We have liquid and we have gas going through here. So this one was a little bit more of a juggling act. Um, but how's the uh how's the liquid coming out of it still? 73 degrees, that's what we want. And is it enough to power everything? Oof, ooh, looks like we have to increase that a little bit. Yeah, we do. We don't have enough for them to take a shower, and some of the shitters aren't exactly in service. Okay, so let's go ahead and increase it some, and then we'll keep an eye on it. Let's say 400. I know we were, like, fine-tuning this yesterday, but we clearly needed, you know, tens of cycles in order to determine whether or not it was enough or not. We also have some automation set up here just to, you know, just to help with this. Keep this, um, uh, regulated. So if it gets too much, they'll just stop. Let me see. Oh, that was the wrong one. Ha 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 ha. Damn it. That's the wrong one to put it on. Hey, that's a good test, though. Let me see. It needs power. Dang, it needs power, too. Oh my god. We're gonna run power just for that thing. Yeah, sure. Kind of want to hear it go off. The bangers. I want to, want to know what kind of dinners you can make with $5. A lot of them. Just get some, um... Furious Robo, have a good night, by the way. Uh, some ramen, I guess. <laughs> yeah, there's not a lot of options. Who was that? What was that from? That was, uh, I don't remember who said what on that. So many people who were, so many elected officials in so many positions have said so many dumb things. I don't even know where to start with this stuff. I don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> uh, especially when my hometown is looking like, like a bunch of assholes on national, national level. Hurts my feelings, man. All right, so that thing's powered now. So when this thing drops down to zero, we should hear a dun -dun or something. We'll see. Dupes want VR? I know. Almost done, guys. Oh, how? Where does that even come from? How are these guys doing? Confined glut, 86, 88. Ooh, I don't think they're going to make it. No eggs in there. Your town, my state, is smaller than Calf. We took... And we look like a bunch of... Oh, okay, smaller than California. Oh, no, I was talking about Las Vegas. That's what's my that's my hometown. So, yeah, sorry. That's what I was talking about. No, are you kidding me? My state looks like the golden child right now. <laughs> like, when this shit is said and done, assuming we keep going at this rate, like, people are going to look at California. Outside of the people who don't like California. Um, uh, yeah. As uh, as an example of uh, a way that w the, uh, as as an example of a way that was um, uh, a way that, that the pandemic was managed correctly. At least that's how I feel about it. By the way, I also have um, just what does the secretary of interior do anyway? <laughs> uh, I also have a natural tile generator uh, mod that I put in because. Well, we might want to just build our own nature reserve somewhere. I'm looking forward to that. Who did they Man, get the fuck out of here. Santiago. Chupe. Um, I like the state park that they converted to a dirt bi bike track. Yeah, I saw that. I didn't see it. Wait, did, did they start using it as... I didn't hear the ding. Did I not make a ding? No. Maybe we didn't notice because everything else going on. Damn it. This damn hammer is just for fun. It doesn't really do anything useful. All right, let's run this again. We did it correctly as well, but it's less than 1% of their seeing a TV yelling. It's all right to be outside and working. I know. Well, I mean, I'm sure if, 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 I don't want to say when, because I, I really hope that it doesn't happen, but if, if there is a second wave and there's a lot of people that end up paying the price because of their own stupidity, uh, 
then um, you know maybe maybe people will be like, okay, hold on a second, maybe this is a problem, maybe it's something we should pay attention to. But boy, has some seriously high hopes for for the American populace in general. Like seriously, seriously high hopes. We're just too, just bullheaded. Like we just have to be right. We have to. I don't know, man. We're so we're so entitled. Let's see. Pause and zoom. Here we go and bloop, and then oh snap, Ned guess. Ned guess. Ned guess. Ah, yo yo. There we go. Okay. Oh, we also put in the notepad mod. Where is that at? Did the research that? Hmm. Five dollar for the lungs. Second wave is inevitable. Uh, mile long lines at the food bank are kind of scary. Uh, I gotta look a bit and gonna give a new escort the... Wait, wait, what? You got an escort? Hey, alright! Terra, alright! Man, there you go! Uh, oh wait, the USS shut up Wesley and I run ST. Oh, ST! Oh, oh! All right. Well, good luck, Taro. Okay, so that's going to do its thing, and I f wow, I feel like we're we should be able to just like wait, wait I, I, where is this actually going? <laughs> I haven't really seen where this is going. Uh, so it goes down, it goes across, it goes out, it goes into space, it comes down. Oh, I dumped it in here. Oh, ah. Uh... Mary takes something someone who has a grass mod things with this lady and maybe she's a trolling, but whatever. Uh <laughs> We could probably go ahead and disassemble, disassemble some of this stuff. Or maybe we could turn around and pick some of that stuff up, but um we should have, we have ice kind of scattered around. Just leave it. It's not melting, technically. It will, though. 33 cycles for this one, 23 cycles for this one. And we're getting to the point where we should probably go and switch everything over. I, I actually thought this would be a little bit faster, uh, siphoning all of this liquid out, but wow, this is taking a really long time. I guess we should probably just go ahead and just start building. I just start moving stuff down. But man, I really hate doing that for some reason. Ugh. Well, let's see. Let's go ahead and build a couple of things and we'll see where our inspiration takes us. So first, maybe start with a couple hydrogens at the top. And maybe we'll build a couple platforms that we'll do. Gas platforms, mesh platforms. We don't really have the metal to spend on a ton of gas plat or uh, mesh. We hardly have enough tiles to just blow on, uh, or metal to blow on uh, metal, any metal tile. Yeah, wow, hmm. We need to find more metal. Let's go start with copper. I feel like copper is going to be the easiest one to, to get more of when we do need it. And let's go and start building. Just as much, as much as we can. Just across. And then we'll start to build level by level. And we'll, we'll cut things out as needed, you know? Like if we need to make more space for blank or maybe add this or that or whatever, then we'll do that accordingly. But right now... We can't. The reason why I don't want to put all the machines in here and let them run is because these things put out a lot of uh, a lot of polluted water, and I don't necessarily want to even accidentally dump polluted water in here and then have to later repair this fucking machine because you know they're, they're, it's going to be filtering, and I don't want to have to filter it. I don't want to, have to do the extra work if I could just avoid it by just not doing that one thing. They're building it really fast, actually. <laughs> good, 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 good. Should give them a little bit of room. Uh, let's see, how tall is a natural gas generator? It's like three tiles tall, right? Let's just go and stick a couple of things in here. Natural gas generator, petroleum generator. That's tall. Okay. Well, I don't think we're going to do petroleum generator right here. Imagine having all that carbon dioxide stuck in here. I have a feeling we're going to be venting this thing pretty regularly. But anyways, no, we're not going to put this in here. We'll just use this for natural gas, hydrogen, things that are relatively clean. Coal generation, all that stuff. We'll put that out in space, literally. Um... I'm not gonna use steam, it's gonna be just hydrogen and uh, yeah, so so just three tiles high is all we need. Three tiles high. Doom, doom, doom. Yes, it will sink to the bottom for sure, but it creates so much 
that it's just going to be a, um, just an absolute. Yep, there it is. Boop. Okay, cool. So that's not 50%. We could go ahead and uh, do the switch, which is easy. There we go. <laughs> that's all we needed. Uh, what is it? Don't take wrong element damage from polluted water? They don't? Oh. What do they do? Just pass on a polluted water? Huh. Hey, what up, Grant? Grant? Hmm. Well. T I L. Alright, okay, so we're out of copper. Let's go ahead and zoom out here while they're working on that and see if we can find some copper. M -m 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 metal. Yeesh. There's so much material just wasted on all these different projects. See, iron ore, copper ore. So it's pink. Pink, pink, pink. Lightish red. Lots of iron ore over here. Maybe we should just make a bunch of steel. Make everything steel. I mean, there's plenty right here. We can get to it pretty quickly. It's kind of a bitch, though. Got dudes climb through all this stuff. What map am I on? Uh, it was a uh, custom map. A f I don't remember what it's called. <laughs> Furia or something like that? No, no, that's uh, that's Riddick. I, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I do not remember what the hell this thing's called. Okay, so we'll dig over. Maybe we just dig down here and just get like every little bit we can. What is down here? What is this? Uh, lead. God, there's lots of lead everywhere, but it's tons of copper. Yeah, we should definitely gut all this, try to get as much uh, copper as we could get. Do I have power out here? This is kind of remote. I don't think so. It's, it was a modded one. Is it Oceania? It was a modded one, so it wasn't the starter one. It said it had one of every biome or something like that, and so I thought it would just be like, cool, this would be a nice, like, long-term experience of going through and trying to, uh, and, and trying everything, you know, go to space, try to, you know, wrangle a, a volcano, like, you know, it'll have everything. Uh, I didn't realize it was going to be, like, an abundance of everything, but it's fine. Like, I don't mind. The game still has its challenges, but this will be, like, kind of just, this is definitely a less... Challenging playthrough. Oh, I wanted to ask that too, Hammer. It says, what I'm annoyed at is if you have polluted oxygen and clean it with chlorine, it doesn't go into oxygen. It stays a polluted oxygen. Kind of annoying. So I have a polluted oxygen vent, uh, infectious polluted oxygen vent, and I have a chlorine gas vent. I wanted to know what happens if I put these in the same room together. Does the chlor- I mean, obviously they don't mix necessarily because gases don't mix like that in, uh, uh, in oxygen included. But I still wonder if it will disinfect as it touches, like as the chlorine bumps into, like as they kind of bump into each other and they're moving and shuffling around, if it will, you know, it clearly- yeah, I figured it wouldn't probably correct the polluted oxygen part, part, portion, but yeah. I mean, honestly, I don't need the oxygen, so it's kind of like whatever, but, but it kills the germs though. Cool. Oh, they're done. Look at this. Okay. So let's, uh, let's have them start going up. And then go over here, get this. Go straight across, get all this they can. Good. Now I can get quite a bit of, uh, of copper to start, and then we can start trimming, start taking this up in layers. A bunch of deodorite. I have some like fat ones, don't I? I think I have some like seriously some big ones. Yeah, the super air foot. Look at this guy. Clean all of them bitches up. Oh, uh, what do we get? A vol pup. Well, fortunately, that one's gotta go. Construction Aaron. Yeah, we need more copper before I start committing more resources to this build. Lead, iron ore, like seriously, I should just make a ton of steel. Oh wait, I, I need the molts. I need um, lime in order to do that. I don't really have any fossil. What did we determine that was? Cause it was under something. I thought it was like a mineral or something, but I wasn't sure. Oh, it's red. Oh, wow, it's deep red. Fossil. Raw mineral. Good. 
And is that not really where we need it? Lots of granite there. Too far. We can't use that for anything good. Mm, wow. Some more fossil over here. Okay, good. So we could definitely make some more lime. It's just going to take actually excavating all this stuff and getting it home. Uh-oh, combat. Oh, they finally got around to killing that thing. Good. Give it a second. Oh, it's still running. Why is it? Oh, it's so quiet because we're in uh, all the way out here. Sedimentary rock, fossil, fossil. Uh, then lots of other stuff. We should explore out here and see what's out here. And also, obviously, go across the bottom and see what we can uh, find, you know, if anything, down here. There's tons of fossil in here with the oil. Man, I guess that's just kind of the biome that, that stuff chills in. Noted. Yeah, next to no line when you're mad, so I had to learn how to farm poker shells. Angry fuckers. Yeah, yeah, I've been, I've been robbing poker shells left and right. Which I think I still have plenty of just naturally out and about, so might be able to uh, farm some of those later if I need to. But I also, have, I think I have a good amount of steel as is. Yeah, I have five, five tons of steel, so we're good for a minute. So hopefully we'll get some copper from this, and then we'll go through and do some sweeps to get more copper from this. There's tons of copper over here on this side. Yeah, there's, there's copper to be had, for sure. Just a matter of getting these guys over here to, to, to take care of it. I wonder if... I should bring this down a little bit. Because they're going to be working down here. So maybe just having a couple extra feet will be good. Mm. Might as well take it down to the... To the bottom. To the abyssal light. There. That should be plastic ladder actually all the way up. That's a huge ladder that they're wasting time on. Hopefully we end up re redoing this and by just putting a um, uh, a tube access point here so that way they could just get in and just shoot across to the other side because that's a lot of time they're gonna be adding here. But once they get that once they get all this uh, plastic laddering in, then they'll be able to come down here and work pretty quickly. And then we can actually continue to expand, maybe? There's tons of fossil out here, too, I'm guessing. Granite, igneous rock, lead. What does the fossil look like? Oh, it looks kind of like, uh, oh, okay, it looks like poop. Uh, yep, fossil. Cool. Let me see, what do I have? A G8. That's not what that's supposed to do. G8. Oh, am I doing that wrong? I guess, I guess. Oh, that's right, yeah, you can't do that with the G tool. And then it was a four. Good. Plenty. Pop the cork out of the copper volcano. Cool it with salt water. Could get salt water. Get it salt and copper if it works right. Um. There's no salt water that's nearby? Well, I mean, no, sorry, not that I tapped into, but yeah, you're right. Maybe elsewhere. Oh, look, there's uh, eggshells. Woohoo. It's more lime. Yeah, let me just let them finish this job here. That ladder's gonna help a, a great deal. So we're out of natural gas over here. That they're cranking through natural gas over here, right? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, good. There's plenty to choose from, for sure. This place has a hot dog with kimchi. Oh, hey, it's like a Chicago Korean style hot dog. That's kind of cool. Get it, try it. Test it for us. <laughs> There's some fossil over here too, actually. Maybe we should go ahead and tap into this as well. There's a little bit of fossil up there. Maybe we can have them step up and then grab some of this too. What is that? Lead? Oh, a bunch of fossil up there too. Damn. Yeah, we'll get it later. Hong Kong. <laughs> Insufficient lime. Yeah, well, that's gonna be... We should probably actually get this rock crusher down here. Or, uh, what else can we... Yeah, I think the rock crusher, right? Poke shell malt. Let's get that thing down here and just off of the... That main line over there. I think there's room on this line, right? Yeesh. Ah. Oh, man, that seems like that's... that's ah, I should right... I probably shouldn't do that, but at the same time, I don't want them up here... Just beating on this and just making all kinds of, uh, generating all kinds of heat. 
Yeah. Yeah, I saw the ethanol. But that's that stuff is cold. What happens when that heats up? There's ethanol all over the place. Like little pools over here. I think I saw some on the other side as well. Yeah. Little pools over here, here, here. It's like 22 degrees. This is the first time I scheduled a line to catch you live. I've enjoyed your content since Game Breaker. Oh boy, Grant. Well, Grant. Uh thanks for joining us. Yeah, I usually stream uh this time of day. Pretty much uh uh what, Tuesday through Friday. Uh, Monday nights, we get together, we either watch movies, which we do that like every other night. Well, not every other night, but at least um, uh, just whatever night uh, in Discord. Or we will, uh, on Monday nights, typically we get together, we play games. Um, and then, uh, and then, then, then the Fridays we do news, typically. We do, we've been doing like every other week uh, lately. And we also have like a game releasing, Chimera XCOM. Chimera is coming out on Friday, so I'm going to postpone the news for that. And then next week we have Gears Tactics. So yeah, I'm looking forward to playing all these turn-based games. I was playing another one. Uh, I think San or, uh, Martha, I think you suggested it. I forget the name. Um, let me pop it open real quick if you don't mind. Da -da 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 -da. Wildermyth. I was playing Wildermyth a little bit. Martha, it was you that suggested that, right? Um, but anyways, yeah, that was it. That's a pretty, that's a pretty good game. I like that one a lot. Yeah, I like that one a lot. That was a lot of fun. I mean, I, I've, I've just started, so I still have to, you know, get back into it and learn all the mechanics and everything, but... You missed Game Breaker, me too. I've been loving the news section, watch it over, over on tubes! Oh, cool! Good, good, good. I'm glad. I am glad. Look at that copper coming in, look at that! We can put 39 more tiles down! Oh, I hate that, leaving that chunk right there. We'll probably cut into that a little bit. As much as I hate cutting into Abyssalite. Unless it's for aesthetics. They want to check out Wilder Myth. Yeah, it's not a bad game. It's not bad. It's, uh, there's a little bit of, uh, the RPG type of, uh, choose your own adventure type stuff. Like, they give you options of things that you can, uh, hold on. I'm executing a dig command. Ah, oh, you see? Escape. <laughs> I think I held it down. Um, uh, anyways, yeah, you, you get some options, uh, dialogue options. You could just kind of choose your own adventure in that way. Uh, so that was kind of cool. I, I don't know if it's... I haven't seen if there's any morality stuff where it's like, this comes into play. God, they keep dropping shit, man. Uh, yeah, I haven't seen if it comes into play with how your characters, how uh, other characters interact with you or whatever. So I haven't really gotten that far yet, but what I have played, I've enjoyed. Also just visually interesting game. What I like, oh, another thing I should say that I like about it too is you can rotate the camera a little bit if you need to. Um, a lot of uh, turn-based games, you know, they have like a board, they kind of treat it like a board that you can't really turn. So you're kind of stuck looking in one direction, but this one you could kind of tilt, take it and tilt and move the camera around if you need to. There is a no drop. That's right. There is a no drop mod. Let's add another mod to the list. There's a way to get around this actually. Just adding a, uh, uh, a block. Let me see what happens. I'm going to drop it again. No. Okay. Um, adding a block every so often. So that way they don't do that. But yeah, I'm just going to leave it alone for now. Eventually conveyors and all that stuff will probably solve a lot of these problems. Matter of fact, I should probably get conveyors running over here now because there's a lot of stuff to mine out. We have sandstone. Let's see everything. Uh, obviously, sand, sandstone, dirt, uh, copper, which of course we're going to get a lot of that. Tactical breach wizards. I'll open up another window, though. Thank you, Elon. Maybe we'll add that to the list, too. Don't drop anything. Um. So they're going to cut that out. And then fill this in. It's slowly coming together. Slowly coming together. A lot of copper. Oh, we still need more though. Let's go ahead and have let's put priority on this. Nine on uh like right by here, and I think somewhere around here. Something like that. That's close. Some crude oil. I know what to do this ethanol. They yeah, they drop shit for all kinds of bullshit reasons. It's true they do, man. They're constantly dropping stuff. Those man, <laughs> for all kinds of bullshit reasons. Man, that's the truth. Okay, good. New printables available. Shine up anthem receipt. Uh, egg. So yeah, now we're now we're living off of uh, this cloud of natural gas here, which is kind of nice. Oh, we don't have anything to see. Uh, Poke shell malts. Let's go ahead and forever that. Uh, Poke shell malt to lime. There's two of them. Weird. 
Egg shell to lime. Fossil to lime. Yeah. There we go. Uh, salt to table salt. Let's go ahead and do that too. Why not? And sandstone to sand. And wolframite to tungsten. Go ahead and dig this out. There. Granite, obsidian. Okay. It's too bad. You can't really use abyss light in any builds, right? Like, I think there's a mod that actually allows you to use abyss light in some um, builds. All right, 25 more. Uh, oh, I see we have this thing. Hmm. We'll go ahead and build. Ooh, I should have done that. Should have done that. Oh, good. Do I trust it? Do I trust it? Do I trust that it really did not just paint? Oh, look at that. It did not. Hey, all right. Cool. Cool. Thanks, Wild Infiltration Turn Base, but the cops are wizards and witches. Huh. That's kind of interesting. Okay. So looking at what we have up here, natural gas geysers, uh, uh, all kinds of stuff. We're going to have to replace some of these tiles with drains, of course, to keep, uh, to keep this, you know, the natural gas geysers from, um, you know, from just basically flooding there. Oh, maybe we can put it down here at the bottom, just let them flood in here. So you're saying that if, if the, if the, if the desalinator picks up the salt water, or it picks up blue water, it just passes through and just goes in over here? Hmm. Well, let's see. How do I want to configure this guy? We want batteries down here. But we don't necessarily need a ton of batteries. We have batteries. We have batteries all over the place. I have them all on different sides, like on opposite sides of transformers. So it's like some of them are on inside of the transformer, some of the outside of the transformer. And I feel like I need to just put them all on the inside and just let them just be just the controller controlling buffer for the entire network, you know? Um, if we have specialized areas that maybe need to have their own power, like emergency power backup, then maybe we'll create a dedicated like switch or something to switch to that power whenever voltage drops to blank, you know, that kind of thing. Um, but at the same time, like batteries or so, that would be like a coal, like a coal generator. That wouldn't really be batteries anyways. So to clean all water in one output. Yeah, I put a, a sieve on there for sure, for sure. Hmm. I mean, that'd be ideal. I mean, that's basically what I'm doing over here. Well, that's, oh, I'm sorry. That's not what I'm doing over here. Uh, oh yeah, no, it's, no, I am. Yeah, it's coming out of here and it's going up into this nonsense here. These right here are not. Like, this is just being mixed with the hey. clean water that we currently have. Oh, hey, Grant. Hey, all right. Yeah. Thank you so much. You should hop in Discord, dude. Oh, what game, wait, what games, uh, what games do you, you just follow the news pretty much? Oh, this is too high. Um, man, we desalinator, sieve. This row right here looks really nice for just like a row of generators or um, natural gas geysers. Ah, generators. And then maybe we can just, we could put a ton right here. And maybe we should, maybe we should just put a ton, like, just around, like, and just let it drop. And then just, you know, instead of having a ton of drains, or maybe put a bunch of drains at the bottom. Once I get this all, all this cleaned out, just head up a ton of drains at the bottom and just let all these things just drip down. It's not a bad idea. That is a really thick wall of abyssalite. And like I said, as much as I don't want to cut into abyssalite, I do feel like this is a little bit too much. A little thank you for the years of entertainment and your attention to solid production quality. Hey, thank you so much. Appreciate that. You guys are my eyes and ears though, man. The production sucks. I blame you guys for not telling me. <laughs> Which doesn't happen often, thankfully. Uh, you guys are pretty good about that. Let's see. Let's go ahead and cut. I want to cut probably like this down here. It's not a set. And we'll leave that way. We have a kind of nice little jagged all the way down to the bottom. Uh, this will give us two more squares of just kind of openness to work with. And then we can put. Let me see how many of these guys are put on top of each other. So one, two, with a little gap in between, right? Uh, I probably won't put anything there. 
And then it looks like we put one, two with a couple in between. Nice. That gave us eight. What are we currently running on? We're currently running on one, two, three, four, five, uh, six, seven. Cool. So this expands our power capability significantly. Uh, then we can put a couple of hydrogen generators if we need to, but we don't really use hydrogen that much. So I don't necessarily want to commit too much to that. This center area we'll use for, I don't know what, we'll figure it out, maybe transformers or something. Um, but having all of these, if we can actually go down even lower with this, it doesn't have to stop there. We can have uh, six of these going down. We'll have to replace them with this tile, of course. But just to get started, yeah, we can have... Let's go and use aluminum, I guess. And then, there we go. And then I can reach that. And they can come up here to reach that. And then we'll do the same thing over here. It's a good dicting soundtrack. Oh, what am I making these things out of? Uh, gold? Oh, that's fine, actually. Gold is fine. Oh, that's a lot of gold, though. How much? Wait, how much? I oh, gotta keep using metal for all kinds of things. Let's see, steel. I have tons of steel, but I, I I feel like... If I use steel, I feel like that's a waste, because if it gets up to the temperature where steel is required, then we're gonna have other problems, you know? So, gold amalgam might be a good start. Oh god, maybe we should just do steel. We just we could just make more steel. We, we will have access to tons of fossil. Matter of fact, probably increasing our steel reserves now. We are, actually. So, let's see, eight of those. What was it, 600 each? 800 each. Okay, so to make eight of these, we would need 6.4 tons. Uh, and that's a lot. What are these other ones made out of? Iron ore, iron ore, iron, aluminum, aluminum. Man, these things are made out of garbage. Fucking tin cans up here. <laughs> Obviously, we don't need it to be anything terribly durable. We just don't have a whole lot of a single metal, you know? It's making moves. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah. Let me make this uh, P1s. Well, that, that, that's more of a concept. Let's not get crazy trying to actually install it. <laughs> <laughs> we're just we're just conceptualizing right now, okay? Make that a one. That's all. Wolf for might. Uh, I think we heard, heard we need that for something later on, maybe. Iron ore, sure. Garbage is my home. That's okay. Let me see. There you go. We could put a break right in the middle and have this go straight down into a uh, into another uh, transit tube access. That'd be pretty good. All those transformers. I guess we could put a transformer all the way across here and then move them around as needed. Try to get some of this stuff in here. Do do do. I'm just gonna leave this pinch of pepper nut up. <laughs> Let's set it to harvest, actually. You know, auto harvest. There we go. Get some uh, pinch of pepper nuts for some folks. And then we will transformers. Let's get a couple transformers laid down. We'll make it priority one. That way they don't mess with it anytime soon. Power transformer. Okay, we need lots of. Wait, is that the big transformer? No. We're gonna need lots and lots of. Um, Makes out of iron. Oh, sweet. Uh, what was I gonna say? We lots, lots of something. <laughs> Forget. Ah, oh, damn it! Clicked. Okay. So we could do, and then the same thing here. You put one more here. See, that's six transformers. Uh, I don't know if that's enough, but boy, getting six lines out of here is going to be pretty difficult. So... Yeah. Let's start with six. Right now we have... How many transformers do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we already have seven. Whoops. Just disconnected my headphones. God 
Couldn't find the hole. Uh, oh, they're building them. Okay, whatever. That's fine. They can build them out of whatever. <laughs> Just make up your own rules, guys. 